Hi everyone, welcome back. I am Dr. Gomati. Today we are going to talk about five journals which are paid and unpaid and which are related to multidisciplinary, computer science, um, chemistry, environmental science and more. So we will be uh, seeing like what are the aspects you have to be very clear while choosing a journal and how you can check whether the journal, uh, how long it will take to publish the papers. So before we proceed, I'd like to tell you that this is my uh, this is my channel, Gomes Tech Talks. Okay, so if you haven't subscribed yet, please go and subscribe now. And if you want to join us, uh, member, which is exclusively for uh, the community members, like you can access various perks, PDFs. You can mail me. I'll be giving you fastest response. Uh, if you are the member of the channel, okay, or else anyhow, I'll be giving the response, but it you cannot expect as fast as. Uh, for the members and regarding the playlist so few playlists which will be very useful for you the first one is uh, SCI Scopus and Extra so already you can see that I have published nearly 69 videos on various publications so of course I have covered almost all the topics right from English um, uh, if languages and mechanical engineering civil engineering multidisciplinary almost everything nursing everything so please go and check that first and uh, you can also see there is an another uh, thing called uh, all about research where you can find various um, very informative videos for researchers how to uh, uh, write your literature review fast how to submit your thesis what is the um, what is the a template for the uh, DC meetings everything you can see here okay so let us go back to the today's session that is uh, the first journal the, the, which is a international journal on recent and innovation trends in computing and communication engineering so you have to check in the scopus see I am publishing this uh, in the month of November okay November 2023 if you're watching this even after November that is December or uh, next year probably 2024 please go and check the Scopus first okay because you know Scopus they will be updating the journal every uh, every quarter so uh, many people started message commenting me that okay this is not listed in the uh, journal this is not listed in the Scopus which means that the, those videos are before uh, uh, one year okay so you have to again check not only my video okay w whatever the video you are watching you know you have to cross check don't simply submit it before cross checking it okay so international journal recent intervention so here you have to check this is the very first thing which is uh, whether it is still under scopus, scopus coverage okay that is important one so it is present and the second third one is the what are the subject area they cover that is engineering electrical and electronic engineering computer science computer science human computer interaction and computer science software so you can just simply click here source home page in order to go to the specific home page you can see here this is the um, journal details some complete details okay next you have to think about how many issues per year okay the very first thing here once you can find that whether your paper is under the scope of this particular journal if your paper is uh, related to electrical or electronic or computer science or uh, specifically on human interaction then of course you can go for this particular journal next one is you have to see how many uh, issues per year they are just going with if it is 12 issues per year of course they will uh, make your um, review process first okay but don't expect your review process to be within 24 hours that is not at all possible if some journal if they made it possible it is not a worth journal okay okay so let's just scroll down you have to see what is the journal publication language and what are the journal information here completely you can check it okay and you can also see like uh, what are the coverage uh, topics they have apart from which are listed in the scopus you can also check that okay and to know more about it you can click on any any specific journal okay any specific these are all the articles which are already published by the uh, journal so you can ch check click here to see how that article like how they have written the article okay uh, so you will get an idea about it so please go and watch any one of this thing and the next thing you can check is what you have to go to the author guidelines okay so this is very important like what are the guidelines for the authors they have like what type of papers you can submit so you have various types of paper one will be the review paper okay you will be reviewing multiple uh, um, multiple papers multiple journals and you will be writing a paper on specific uh, review 
another one will be the research paper okay you will be submitting your own research paper and apart from this you have a self canon articles technical notes whatever so few journals no they will only go with the original research few journals will have combination of research and review article so you have to check whether you can submit it here and um, uh, you have to see some more thing like what is the plagiarism policy i think they'll be accepting 10 percentage this is what common okay so don't go with more than 10 percentage and you can see that um, if you want to submit an article so what are the things which you want to do uh, consider okay all these things okay how you can submit your article and what is the charges what is the, um, what is how many cost what is the cost of that okay everything you have to go and check it first so if you have any queries in between that okay so what you have to do is what you have to send a mail to the editor even that mail i have uh, uploaded how to write a mail that i have uploaded in the all about research playlist so instructions to the author you can see what is the plagiarism check what they are using they are using turn it in okay so it should not be more more than 12 20 percentage and um, uh, in the case of exclusion of references if you are not including the references it should be less than five percentage okay and the quality check paper submission criteria everything okay so you have to check for this and they have article publication charges which is 400 usd i think 400 usd is of course nearly thirty-three thousand. okay more or less like you can just calculate and let so this article processing charges is fixed for 10 pages and it will exceed so plus 95 uh, usd you have to give for every additional papers okay so uh, you have to check all these things and what if you wanted to withdraw or, or publish the paper so what i could uh, um, analyze from the researchers it what is what you are ready to write a paper but you are not ready to review the journal information that is very very important so before because you are paying nearly 30 to 50 thousand right if you wanted your um, publication to be very fast then what you have to see is what you have to just go and check the complete information like whether, whether this is fine okay whether you can really submit it what are the um, what are the other policies they have everything you have to go and check and you can and see here you have a downloading option so this is really uh, and they have the acceptance rate okay this is 12.6 percentage which means that if you if they are receiving 100 uh, papers they will accept 12 papers which should be of high high uh, quality paper okay it is indexed and it is indexed since 2019 so you can you can believe whether uh, whether this will be there or uh, still your um uh, still your you complete your phd or something okay and few journals they will openly tell like how many days they will take for uh, initial submission towards the um, uh, review okay so this will be i think it will take only few days to give uh, send you the uh, comments and everything okay you can check that all these things here this is a fast publishing journal next let us talk about malaysian journal of science Okay, Malaysian Journal of Science is a multidisciplinary and this is there since 20, 2006. So, you can believe this as well. You can launch this about the journal. First, learn about the journal. Okay, that is very, very important. And then, just, just go to for authors. If you are not finding a proper uh, link in the journal, you can go to the for authors. And you can learn about it. What are the important notes to the authors? Like, what type of uh, papers you can submit? So, as I told, you have to just think about it. And these are all the cost so that is a 52 dollar okay 52 dollar 52 dollar is nearly uh, you just calculate like 80 dollars or 82 dollars per so it is very less okay and uh, where uh, you they'll be uh, they'll be just doing all your uh, um, reviews and everything okay so you can find a um, uh, malaysian journal and you can see what is the current issue and you can also check whether uh, whether uh, how many how many publications they are doing per year so you can see here that I think three publications okay fib one one is february and second one is june and uh, the third one is what the third one is what um, uh, october okay so these three uh, months and you can also see like how many uh, how many articles they are publishing in every month okay because that might be in uh, that might be a huge one and uh, let us go to so here you can see this is how your um, uh, pay, uh, this is how they have they are expecting like how your paper should be okay so just go through few uh, uh, papers in order to understand how, how they are how what quality they are expecting for 
let us go to the third one vietnam journal of science and technology where they are specifically focusing on chemistry environmental and it is of course i think it's multidisciplinary let us go and check it so it's there uh, in scopus so this is vietnam journal of um, so here they have natural products materials environment electronics and communications mechanical engineer engineering so all these things are there and here you can see that what is a peer review stage and what um, uh, that is authenticate they are using this plagiarism and uh, you can see also you can see here that what is the uh, cost of this what is the plagiarism policy article processing charge there are no charges for author submission great okay so this is uh, uh, literally they will take only few days see your days of acceptance you can see here 130 days okay days to reject 44 days so if you are publishing today within one and a half uh, one and a half month you will be getting uh, the result if the paper is not accepted and uh, uh, if they are accepting so they will take uh, one more month okay one or two more months to accept it and uh, yes here you can see this is the uh, paper which is published in vietnam journal of science okay so when th when they have received the uh, uh, paper is what 19th january 2023 and it is accepted in 18th march 2023 okay so here whatever the uh, data they have given is what approximate data it may happen before like before or prior to that particular date okay so you can see here it is of course it is published within two months right so it will be easy for submitting uh, here okay you can also ask if they uh, uh, so you can mail them okay sometimes you know you can mail them and ask because since they have uh, subject clarification so here they have few more subjects which can be included here so you can see if you wanted to submit your uh, article so you can send that to the uh, journal and ask whether uh, they are ready to accept this okay so you can see here okay it's completely so it is related to the uh, technology so the fourth one is what journal of king south university computer and information science so the publisher is king south university and it is 2014 to present grade so here you can see this is 2014 to present and um, you can if you just click on the source home page you can see that this is what king south university and the article processing charge is very huge here dollar 1450 which is nearly uh, 1 lakh 30 thousand something okay but the time for the first decision is 15 thousand so but you may think like Kumati, i don't have this much amount so how to do that so you can either you can collaborate with someone uh, who is working in an international uh, university so they will be getting a, a scholarship or a ref refunding pro policies for that so you can get their uh, uh, connection and uh, they will be sponsoring it for you and you can publish it okay so that is the one uh, this because this is very shortest time and the scope of this particular thing is like information technology so you can see it's a computer science and general computer science okay so you can ask for that and there is an another you can just click on this information where it will show you that what are the open access policy here so just go here and understand whether you can avail for any uh, wave off okay so you have the possibility to avail for the wave off so you can check uh, you can send a mail to them uh, to avail the wave off so how to write a mail to wave like get the wave off so for that also i have already written uh, i have already published a video on writing a wave of uh, letter to the editor in my playlist you can go and check it is all about research playlist so you can check it there um here you can see like how to write a wave of letter and um, everything okay so everything so here letter to the editor to reduce the apc charge okay you can check that so this is what about uh journal king south so of course you are getting a fastest response here within 15 days okay so let us go to the next and last journal which is trends in science okay trends in science which is by valelik university so they are since 2021 to present so if you click here so this is trends in science you can see here that it is review speed is 40 days okay and uh, nine percentage of acceptance rate and um, uh, you can see this is a q3 journal you can also see that there is an article processing charges there and they are publishing 12 issues per year so just let us just click on this article processing charge to see how much they are asking for and uh, here you can see that the article processing charge um authors will be upon okay 
yeah 1000 10500 thb which is approximately 300 usd so 300 usd approximately comes around 22000 i think okay so yes i think this will be better right because it is getting you like within 40 days of time and you can also see about the aim and scope okay so you can see this is biological science uh, physical science and the health science again you can see the further uh, um, uh, classification so computational biology and informatics for example even though you are doing your um, you are doing your research in computer okay you are do, you are domain is computer science but you are doing your research in a cross domain like computer with in um, a medicinal field or computer in biological field then you can submit it here okay computational biology and bioinformatics computational chemistry so you can see all these things here so that is what uh, they have given here that this is the, you will get a fastest response here yes that's all about the today's video we have discussed about uh, five journals which are multidisciplinary which will have a fastest which will give you a fastest reply and few journals are costly like few journals you have to pay for the uh, pay for uh, publishing and uh, few journals one or two journals are free here so if you have any queries please leave the query in the comment if i am taking time please excuse me because of uh, uh, official and uh, personal thing so i will just take some time so any other thing please leave me a message thank you take care bye bye